this is the latest fiddle I watched a YouTube guy in Arizona I think it is some desert gold looking for gold in the desert and uh, he made a sand filter sand filter is in this bucket and the sludge the tailings goes in this bucket not the tailings the uh, oh, what it, it's, tailings goes in this bucket and it flows through a pipe into another bucket he had he had these nice um, seals anyway, I, I pretty much got the idea from him Alan's gold mining is, is, is really uh, uh, interesting to watch and silly too but if you like silly go and watch him if you like serious stay here anyway that, what's happening here I got a piece of I think it's 40 mil PVC drill two holes and now that and that problem is it kind of like leaked what I got is a bicycle tube and cut it made you know made a little like a washer kind of a thing it's if you can see this black or you can't I don't know the Sun the black so you, that rubber hopefully seals it here and there and a little bit leakage is not a major drama but yeah, it would be nice if there was none Alan gold mining he gets these seals from the internet they're very cheap I, I couldn't be stuffed maybe if I have the rubber rips or this or that I will make an effort to get those seals what he's talking about so anyway um, 20 litres of so that's that they're joined together so this is just for a pump this is just for a pump and this is just for a sluice what happens is that the clay and shit I'll show you oh, I haven't got much in here I just but this crud stays on the bottom and I got the hole is maybe an inch and a half above the bottom so I can build up an inch and a half of crud without any issues very little only the suspended particles will actually push through into this one which are a much finer dust which will end up going through my pump but anyway I'm, that's that now I'm gonna put it all together oh, 20 litres I can put it in this one too it doesn't matter I just rather put it in here so they find their own level I was hoping I could do it with less than 20 litres but 20 litres is good I might actually need more um, so the water level is above the input and the output anyway so that's that um, I put this together this is the same this part here I got another spring to hold this uh, thing up like that. It goes like that. The funnel and trommel goes on there. Uh, that's it. Uh, the pump. This is this is the pump. I I managed to get it working. I put another motor in there I had from another dead pump I got two cheap things in order this is my cage it's half inch mesh um, made into a cage and wrapped around some uh, whatever it is birthday uh, not birthday some kind of a veil tablecloth anyway and that goes so that just sits in there there and that this the same pretty much everything the same this goes in here to catch the clay particles uh, and the small shit and to catch the bigger shit um, I mean that's pretty much everything I 
This is, and I turn it on now, the water. This sucks up. Um, I like a bit more water than that. My experience tells me that's as soon as this uh, net thing starts clogging up, um, I'm going to have it issues. So I put a bit more water here. I got water here. Uh, I'll put in this one. One. Maybe I'll put one more. I pro probably still not enough. But anyway. That, see over there, this water is about a good amount, about an inch above the hole. Whereas this one's an inch below. That's telling me That's telling me I got, maybe this is higher than that, I don't know. But it, it's telling me I need a larger diameter, but it's, it should be fine. Let's, let's see what we got over here. This here, uh, I brought some tub of material home. Very, very useful for this situation. Heaps of um, plant matter in there, wood, grass, leaves, and heaps of dirt. So, it will, oh, I need to put water in here, otherwise it's hard to dig. Which is, on the creek, I'll be having water in there too, anyway. So this is test very similar to what I will actually be doing on the creek. And the closer you're testing matches what's going to happen at the creek, the more accurate, um, mean, the more me meaningful your test will be. You don't want to just have a test that only works in the backyard, which a lot of times I seem to do that. Uh, one issue I'll be having is I'm only doing a, a five litre bucket whereas on the creek I'll be doing like seven or eight litres or five whatever I feel like um, actually this will be more like four litres I'm already getting tired of digging I think I need more water. Okay, that's enough. Four litres. It's it's just to show as a proximate test. So this goes here. I get a bit more water for that. It's, it's hard to dig. Uh, hard to sh spoon it over. Okay, let's turn this over, around. I will be watching that uh, bucket there and the pump. See now, now, if I have water issues, which I will, I can see what's going on now. I can see my pump. Before it's tucked under here, I don't know what's going on. Now I can see it. Anyway. As this rocks and shit 
starts filling up this tub, the water level will rise and hopefully it will go in there, the extra water. And I can see already inside my cage I need to stop. Inside my cage is less water than inside my tub. So I, I bang like that just to vibrate the particles down. And that, that didn't last long. I actually need to clean it. So I have to turn it off. I need to actually remove this and do like that. Ah, oh, remove that. Do like that, that, tap, tap. And that's that. Now I can put it back. A lot of mucking around. But anyway, I'll slowly build this up. Okay, now I can continue for a bit longer. That issue I just had then is not about the diameter of that pipe, that was about the um, my mesh around the cage blocking up and it's just about to do it again I didn't get any I got nothing for my trouble so I need to turn this off again okay so that's this is bad um, but at least so what I have to do have a bucket standing by here and do that that might solve it. Let's try now. Let's see if I can get more than one trowel in. Um, water. I know what I can do. The pump is too close to the wall. I will um oh, shit. Now now the, now water can get everywhere. I should be able to finish this little bucket now. Tip that bucket. Oh, this this is no good. Hundred times up and down. But better I learn about this shit now than at the creek. So I get that shake it up, get the crap out of it, most of it. Here I'm having a problem because I've wrapped my thing around. So I've got two layers of um, mesh here. I will snip that so that there's only one layer. So it doesn't actually overlap as much. See, there's so much crap floating in here. Anyway, now, now there's enough I can finish this. At least this bucket's empty now. But Let 
little bit of water. And then, a little bit of water. And in, and that's that. And it blocked up again. That's a nonsense. Uh, I had it too close to the wall again, maybe. I don't know. T turn it on again. This is filthy material I'm putting in. But I need filthy material so that when I get not so filthy I won't have an issue. If I make it for clean material when I go there I'm going to have an issue. That's working fine now. Um, I turn this off. So there's the problem. Cuck blocking my filter. Um, anyway, so this can get out the way. This over here. We'll see if we, see if we actually got any gold in this material. There should be at least one piece there, a fly sheet or something. Or not. I have run this before and I got two easy visibles, or two bogus nuggets. So this one didn't seem to have any. Let's check together. I can see one. Is it visible? I think I can see two, maybe three. This is material from Gardener's Road Ford, just close to the vehicle. I wasn't particularly interested in whether there's gold in it or not. I just wanted something to for testing. One Vogus Nugget and uh, one, two, three, four, four bits of fly shoot, maybe five. That's it's not about the gold though, but just to show that it catches. Um, so that's that. I will. Um, what's what's uh, what comes in here? Not a lot. Very. It's very fine and very little of it because it can't get up the step. It's in here. Cuck and here. Cuck as well. So I'll, I'll fix that up. I'll, I'll be working on this thing here. What it is, the, when, the, when this is against the wall, that means all that is blocked by the tub. I need to put this, I, dr I drilled the p pipe in the wrong spot, I should have drilled it, not in the middle here, I should have drilled it over here, so that I can have the pump more in the middle. Then I've got the whole circumference of the, um, the cage for material to come in. I'm going to abandon this uh, tub, it's too big anyway, I don't need it that big. I'll get another one and uh, I'll sort that out. But for now, I will um, cut some of this off where it's overlapping. Okay, uh, I don't know if I'm going to be back. Is there something else to say here? I don't know. Maybe just leave it. When, I, when I'm on the creek, I will show it. Or, or maybe I will test something. Over. That I've done since that test. Where, where it overlapped, it was double and triple and so I removed excess overlap still and put it all back together so that's that that will go into the cage this is like such 
No, that. I got a 45 degree here doing laying around from some project. What I'm going to do, put this, instead of having this straight out, it will dribble, it will flow through more this way, away from the pump. I, I just want to try it. So that just goes over the end of that. Now the pump will have to go more in the middle, like here. I may, I may need to um, extend the, the well, once I get this tidied up um, like like working respectably I'll shorten this tube I, that's the piece I had I'm going to shorten it and then I can have a shorter piece here, but for now, sits uh, one there. And this does that reach? Yeah, that reaches. I need to. Um, Shit, I went too much. That that piece is too too short. It's mucking things up over there. Yeah, that's plenty. This comes out. This one on. And a longer one. Uh, that's it. Okay. That goes like that. Then after I tidy this all up. See this now, by putting the pump more in the middle, I got now all this wall needs to be clogged whereas before I only had this and this and this bit had triple overlaps and double so that should be much better and like I said I'll shorten that so that this comes closer uh, and then that means I can shorten this why why is that the that's too long now and that one's too short Leave it. That's fine. The other one was. It's all. Everything's fine. Okay. I'm not going to run it. I, I need. I got a lot of tailings still still in there. I'll be back later. Over.